Well, it's back to reality this morning with our temperatures. We enjoyed a couple mornings this week with temperatures well into the 50s. We know that's not normal for December this morning. It's much cooler. Temperatures in most areas right around 30 degrees. And we have seen the winds really settle down, but still a bit of a breeze does make it feel like the mid 20s. So make sure you grab the heavy coat this morning, maybe a warm beverage here as well. Now, with the colder weather coming, of course, I wanted to remind everyone winter, it's almost here officially. We see winter officially begin next week on Tuesday. It's four days from now. It'll begin at 1059 in the morning. So uh, although winter begins, we're still kind of waiting. The snowfall is on hold here. We've been seeing no measurable snow yet this month. We average about six inches of snow in December, and we can look all the way to about Christmas, and I don't see any measurable snow yet. So again, we're kind of off to a slow start there with the snow and we're not expecting any snow for us today. We're tracking quiet weather at least to start. And you know, you would think with the cold front that moved through and the sunshine that we're gonna see this morning, you would think, okay, we're looking at a, a great start to the weekend, but this is not gonna last too long because we have a new system forming along this front down to our south. We have showers building. You can actually see over parts of the parts of the Ozarks of Missouri and the Arkansas. You can already see how it's lifting back to the north and there'll be a system developing down here across Texas that's gonna lift north and bring back the moisture we've got a pretty good chance of rain coming our way as we head into the course of late tonight into tomorrow. So looking at those chances for rain. You notice throughout the day today, not really worried about it. There's a very slight chance by this evening. And then you notice by 10 p.m., about a 50% chance to see some rain. And then after midnight, all bets are off here. We're going to see widespread showers by tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. The chance is pretty well out of 100% across the area. So looking at our sky cast, the clouds will gradually thicken. So soak up the sunshine while it's here this morning because by noon the sunshine is going to be filtering through those clouds and the clouds will continue to thicken as we go through the rest of the afternoon hours and there could be a spotty shower down to the south but I think by and large we're going to stay dry through the daytime hours here. If you have evening plans, I think even then it's not going to be widespread rain, but after 6 p.m. I would definitely have the rain gear with with you because we could see a few showers working in. But then you notice after midnight how the rain becomes widespread and at times there'll be some moderate bursts of rainfall moving through. And as we go throughout today, tomorrow, the rain gradually starts to decrease a bit in coverage. And I do think by the afternoon after about 12 p.m. we're pretty well dry. But it's going to be chilly, it's going to be breezy, still very cloudy, and we could even see a few spits of rain or snow even in the afternoon hours. We'll see rainfall with this system around a half inch to three quarters, so it looks like a pretty good soaking coming our way. And as we look at your forecast heading into next week, we're going to quiet things down for us. And that's really some welcome news heading towards Christmas. If you, are ha if you have some travel plans heading into next week, well, it looks like Sunday, Cool but dry, 36, 43 with sunshine on Monday. And then as we look to the middle of next week, a brief cool down, but it looks like we may warm back up again by Christmas Eve. Next chance of rain arrives by then as well.